hi guys thank you so much for clicking on the video it's sorry to know me again i trust you guys are doing very very well thank you for joining me here in my little corner here on youtube where i share all things makeup lifestyle fashion and whatever is going on in my mind at that time or on my mind at that time okay guys so thank you so much for clicking on the video while you're here you may as well subscribe and hit the bell button to get notified when i have new content up i try and upload every single week i have a full-time job so i can't afford to do this on a full-time basis but when i whenever i have something to share i'm always here every other week okay guys so like comment share and most of all subscribe you're already here you may as well just click the bell button okay so for the video of today this video was inspired by my big brother we were talking in talking a few weeks ago during the government shutdown and he encouraged me to do a video that is focused on those who cannot those who are suffering from the government shutdown here in the united states and i decided to do this with a twist it's valentine's day coming up very soon and i wanted to celebrate valentine's day or just do my own little spin on creating a valentine's day date night look or a look this look will be i will be featuring items that are ten dollars or less you don't have to go all out this on my channel here i try and use as much as drugstore as possible as much as some i try and use a mix of both drugstore and i end because i know that not not that many people can afford to splurge on makeup but i try and use as much drugstore as possible as well so this in creating this look i use majority of drugstore items items that i got from target from walmart from my local beauty supply stores and target and tj maxx as well i also shop for my makeup at tj maxx i try and grab the, the bargains once in a while while i'm in there so this look all the items i used in this video to create this look as you can see actually retail for ten dollars or less i'm not sure how much they retail for if you are out of the united states but every item i use here with ten dollars or i get ten dollars or less from the foundation to the concealer um some of these items you guys have seen me use already some of these items i haven't used before so this will be like sort of a first a first impression on certain items particularly the foundation and um, i was blown away the first time i tried this item and for that to think it was a bargain and to get this quality i'm gonna stop talking now so if you want to see how i created this look continue to continue watching and don't forget to like comment share and i'll catch you guys at the other side of the video okay guys bye so guys let's get started with today's festivities i've already primed my face as you can see i've done my brows for my primer i use the elf all control primer mist this retails about six to seven dollars depending on where you get it either at walmart or at target for my eyeshadow base i use the makeup revolution conceal and define and this i got this at Ulta. so let's get started guys for the eyeshadow we're going to be using we're going to be using the melissa michelle blink on the glam eyeshadow palette this i got this is a collaboration with her and Ulta. this is what it looks like i've already started playing with this palette as you can see so let's get started with the festivities of today so i'm going to be taking my pencil brushes from the crayon case and i will be using i will take the shade florida interesting name guys to act as my transition shade now to deepen the crease i'm going to take the shade i, th I think this is pronounced as oi <laughs> this shade here this berry shade here and put that to deepen the crease then i would like to do a halo a uh, halo cut crease today guys so i uh, makeup revolution just launched the cut crease canvas full coverage eyeshadow base this is what it looks like it's a white base and i got the shade hello this all hello this also retails for nine dollars at altar so we're going to use that to create a halo effect so i'll be taking the shade dude guys that's what it says here taking the shade dude and tapping that where i just cut the crease 
and just build that, just continue to build on that. Taking my pencil brush and taking the shade OI again and just putting that, using that to define the, in, the outer corners of the eye. Now for extra drama, guys, I will take the shade, hey guys, here, this shade here, and I will be tapping that on my lid, but for X, I need to wet the brush to give it something to idea to. I will take the shade Boo Bears here and use that to just clean, to just further define my crease on top, that's all. It came with a glitter pen. This was the tip, it came with a glitter tip applicator and I just want to put that above the crease as well just to give it a more dramatic look this will be similar to the christmas look i created then i will take the shade manifest here the shade here voila there we go let that dry for a minute while I just line my bottom waterline. Okay guys, so we're done with the eyes for now. We will be moving on to our face. For our foundation, we're going to be using the Elf Flawless Finish Foundation. This retails for about six to seven dollars, but I got it at three three dollars at Target. And I must say, I am pleasantly surprised. I'm pleasantly surprised because of a how it smells, b the finish. It's not a matte finish; it's a natural finish which i actually don't mind you guys know i usually like matte foundations but this i actually do not mind and i've been wearing this all week i actually i was wearing this foundation when i took a trip to sephora and i the um customer service agents they were actually complimenting me on my foundation and how good it looked so i would say that yes i am very 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 surprised at the quality of this foundation and I think this is this is I found my winter foundation our, our concealer we're going to be using my LA girl pro concealer in the shade toast this is one of my favorite concealers to use It. I'm going to be using my Black Radiant foundation stick in the shade Chocolate Dripped to contour. Hey. So to set my under eye, to set my highlighter, I'll be using the black radiance true complexion loose setting powder in the shade banana and this retails for $7.99 at target to set our entire face we're going to be using the bare minerals original setting powder and this retails for i got it at $3.99 at tg For our blush, we'll be using the Milani Baked Brush. This is in the shade Rose Doro, and this retails for $7.99. By the way, 
so we're gonna set our shy fridge with an nyx match finish setting spray this retails for 7.99 or 8.99 Ulta Target. for our lips we're gonna be using covergirl's temp seduction red lip and i know my friend topper is actually boy screaming right now saying no but oh well it's valentine's day so i'm gonna use a red lip For my highlight, I'm going to be using the Makeup Revolution Vivid Baked Highlighter. This is the shade Rose Gold Light. You guys have seen me use this several times. This retails for um, $6.99 at Ulta. So my darlings, this is the finished look. What do you guys think? So I think for the most part, I stuck with what I was trying to do, trying to use items, drugstore items that are below $10 or less. Um, bowling on, bowling on the budget, as I would say, as I would like to say. Apart from the bare minerals setting powder, that is actually that actually retails for about twelve to thirteen dollars. But I was able to get that at a bargain at Target for about three dollars because that was on sale, and I really like it a lot. So I really hope that you guys have a fantastic Valentine's Day. Don't do anything I wouldn't do, and if you don't have a Valentine's Day, it's just you take that time out to enjoy yourself, to love yourself treat yourself go out and to a meal you don't have to splurge but all in all enjoy the day because it's a day to celebrate love I know every other day we celebrate love but this is especially that we set aside for love anyhow so enjoy your day enjoy your weekend and I'll catch you guys on my video for next week where I will be doing a recreation of the makeup look of one of my favorite youtubers so thank you guys so much for watching the video and I will catch you guys on the flip side Bye guys. Mwah.